If you were planning on heading to the lake shore for the holiday weekend, you probably weren't going to go swimming because we know those water temperatures are still too cold for that. But when you do eventually decide to go for a swim in the lake or even a swimming pool, should you be worried about potentially catching COVID-19? 13 on your side health reporter Val Lego connects the dots. Memorial Day weekend is the unofficial start of summer, which usually means heading to the pool or water park. But is it safe during a pandemic? Let's connect the dots. Just in time for the holiday weekend, the CDC has issued guidelines for swimming pools during the coronavirus outbreak. It says there is no evidence COVID-19 can spread through water in pools, hot tubs, spas, or water play areas. It says the chemicals put in that water, like chlorine and bromine, inactivate the virus. But public pools encourage users to wear face coverings when they are not swimming and to practice social distancing when lounging around. The water is still a little too cold to take a dip in lakes and rivers, but how safe are they? That gets into slightly murkier territory. According to scientists, similar coronaviruses have been shown to survive in fresh water, at least temporarily. But according to the experts, in a large body of water, it would not pose a risk because it would be diluted. When it comes to salt water, there is not a lot of research on whether COVID-19 can survive. Some researchers have raised concerns about, let's put this gently, wastewater. It's often found near beaches, but so far testing of human waste has found the samples not to be infectious. Connecting the dots, I'm Val Lego, 13 on your side.